Good morning, family. This is Miss Norma. This is our reading for March the 10th. Hello to YouTube. Hello to TikTok and the other venues wherever this video is going. And welcome, welcome once more to everyone. Thank you for the new subscribers. Thank you for um, those steadfast um, individuals who stay throughout the course. So blessing and healing to all of us. And thank you, Abba Father. In Jesus' name, amen. Our reading for March the 10th is From the Fullness of My Grace, from the little book, Jesus Always. From the fullness of my grace, you have received one blessing after another. Stop for a moment, beloved, and ponder, and ponder the astonishing gift of salvation by grace through faith in me, because it's entirely a gift not as a result of works. This salvation is secure. Your part is just to receive what I accomplished for you on the cross, believing with faith that was given you. This undeserved love and favor is yours forever. My grace has infinite value, amen. Multiple blessings flow out of grace because of its extraordinary fullness guilt feelings, hallelujah, melt away in the warm light of my forgiveness. Your identity as a child of God gives your life meaning and purpose. Relationships with other people improve as you relate to them with love and forgiveness. The best response to my bountiful grace is a heart overflowing with gratitude. Take time each day to think about it and thank me for blessings in your life. This protects your heart from the weeds of ingratitude that spring up so easily. Be thankful. Our first scripture lesson is John 1, 16, and it says, From the fullness of grace we have received one blessing after another. Ephesians 2, 8, verses 8 and 9. For by grace you have been saved through faith, and this is not your own doing. It is a gift of God, not a result of works, so that no one may boast. Amen. Yet to all who received him, to those who believed in his name, he gave the right to become children of God. And lastly, Colossians 3.15, let the peace of Christ rule in your hearts to which indeed you were called in one body and be thankful. Amen. Thank you, Abba Father, for this reading this morning. Thank you for the release of the power of the scriptures. Thank you for understanding. Blessing and healing, Lord, to all of the land. Thank you, Abba Father. In Jesus' name, amen. And family, remember that the greatest love of all is the, great, is the love of Jesus Christ. And he's our Lord and our Savior. Amen. Have a blessed day. This is Ms. Norma signing off. Amen.